Consumer data collection is quickly growing as a way to help the industry. Consumer privacy, however, must always remain top of mind. Uh, there are lots of ways to collect data. Um, there are ways, unfortunately, uh, that data is being collected illegitimately uh, that, that need to go away, and there are ways that data is being collected legitimately that makes companies and industries better. Uh, for example, eBay and Amazon. The way that they use customer data to present products to you that are of interest to you, they don't have to know who you are to do that. Mm -hmm. um, that's where we find ourselves. We, we don't have to know who the individual is. We prefer not to know who they are. 98% of the 300 million shoppers we have in our database, we have no idea who they are. But learning from the aggregate of that data helps everyone in the industry. OEMs know which cars to build, which colors to paint those cars, where to distribute those cars. Mm -hmm. That's good for the industry. When we start delving into people's personal information, trying to take a piece of information and figure out who the person is and market to them, that's what needs to stop happening and that will go away. The regulation will be around customer privacy. Um, we do, most of our data doesn't involve individuals' personal information at all. It's the aggregate of 20 million shoppers a month that teaches us what to do with our industry and our inventory mm -hmm. from the OEM down to the dealer. So you're right, the privacy concerns will include collecting data legitimately by having tracking code on the website as opposed to pixel tracking mm -hmm. or data scraping. Those mm -hmm. techniques will have to go away and legitimate tracking will be the forefront of legitimate uh, data usage.